CBS 2 assignment editor Mike Rogers joins us live with a dangerous situation that happened while the president was in town. Yeah, guys, some pretty tense moments in the skies above Orange County last Friday. This all happened when the pilot of a Cessna flew into some restricted airspace near the president. The U.S. Air Force scrambled some fighter jets, and I want to have you listen to that interaction that we just obtained. So you can hear there the U.S. Air Force trying to get a hold of that Cessna pilot. I just spoke with the CBS News transportation producer, and she told me that was just a number of ways that the Air Force was trying to get a hold of this guy, including what they call headbutts, which was where fighter jets actually put their faces in front of the plane to try to get his attention. They also may have launched as many as 10 flares at the pilot to try to get him uh, to pay attention to what they were saying. Eventually, they were able to communicate with, with him, and he did exit the airspace. I want to show you my computer real quick so I can show you what that airspace looks like. That outer ring is a ring where pilots can fly into as long as they have a flight plan. That inner ring is an absolutely no-fly zone. So you can see by that first video, that pilot was in that absolute no-fly zone. This all happened while President Biden was down at Irvine Community College last week talking about affordability and reducing prices for Americans. None the wiser to everybody on the ground that this whole thing was unfolding above them. Now, eventually, that pilot did return to Chino Airport, which is where he was intended to go to begin with. He was flying in from Arizona. He was met by authorities on the ground, and you can bet the FAA is investigating. This is a pretty serious offense. He could lose his pilot's license, depending on what the investigation reveals. Guys?